Welcome to Twinkle Park. Oh, shoot! I've lost Amy. I bet that robot hauled butt after her. I'd better catch her before it does. Nah. Let's just go, uh, go race cars. Twinkle Circuit sub-game. These are fun. I mean, it's pretty much the same thing, but I'm in it for the It Doesn't Matter remix. That and I do like the song that plays normally. Okay. Turning isn't great. You could do this with pretty much every character. Well, I don't know about Gamma, though. I don't think I've ever done this with Gamma. Maybe he can't get into Twinkle Park because they don't allow robots into Twinkle Park. I don't know, actually. Right, that was pretty bad. Oh, well. Woohoo! 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 Yeah, when we get to Gamma, I'm gonna have to check that out. Oof. Yeah, it's so good. I love how they just mix this song into that. Honestly, I was about to say they should make a Sonic racing game, and I'm an idiot. There's like three of them. Actually, there's more than that. There's the Sonic Drift games on the on the uh, the Game Gear, which I own. There's Sonic R, um, Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing, and then Sega and Sonic All Stars Racing Transformed. Oh my God, these corners are ridiculous. But yeah, I don't know. I, I think for some reason they never really quite got the Sonic Racing game, like, down. Like, I like the Sonic Drift games. I, I know no one else does, and I don't know why. Because they're, they're fun games. It's kind of just like pole position with Sonic. Because uh, I owned a Game Gear when I was growing up, and I those were games that I always played. And, um... I like Sonic R. Sonic, it's another game like almost no one likes, but I love Sonic R. Sonic R has a great soundtrack. I think it's got, yes! as long as you can do it correctly, it's got good gameplay. But I, I really would have loved to have seen them try Sonic R again. This has always been really ominous music. What does continue or quit mean? Does continue mean continue the, alright, I'm going to go with quit. Alright, phew. That was going to take me back to the menu. But yeah, I would like to see them try the Sonic R Welcome formula again. Oof. I don't know what Sonic was doing there. Like, I think the thing is, is that Mario has just had so many good racing games at this point that it's a little hard for Sonic to, like, catch up. Because I don't understand why they keep putting Sonic in cars. It's like, no one wants to see that. No one wants to see a Sonic racing game where he's in a car. That's why I like Sonic R, is because he's not in a car. So in this level, we're going to be going up, down, and all around. I, that's a guarantee. Destroy the capsule. This is one of the best levels in the game. It's just one of those that's always fun. And I do love the Generations remake of this level. I don't know what I like better. Like, there's some levels that they did in Generations that I like better than the original levels. I really don't know about this one. And the music. So good. Whoa. So good music. What's on Sonic's head? It looks like there's something on his head. I don't even know. 
Oh, too fast for you. Oh, hold on. Taking the top path. The lower path is for losers! I didn't mean to yell losers, I just thought I was gonna fall into a bottomless pit. This is a really good use of the speed shoes, by the way. Oh god. I'm gonna fall. I always feel so nervous. I, I feel like the Dreamcast controller makes Sonic a little slippery than the, uh... GameCube version. And I didn't know you could actually get hurt by that. I figured I would just go right through them. I didn't give the game enough credit, I guess. I'll never understand if these guys are actually cops, or if they're just like Robotnik cops. Like, are those guys the actual authority in, uh, in Station Square? Oof! No, I wanted to take, uh, oh well. You win some, you lose some. Did I just, like, homing attack that one guy and he just disappeared? Just, like, straight up disappeared? Alright, I'm not even gonna bother with those guys anymore. Goodbye. Oh, we're coming to the cool part. I love that little musical bit there, though. Oh, this is so difficult to get him to go over quick enough. Did he just say, alright? Oh. I love how many unique pieces of music there are in this game that play like once and then never again. And Sonic is probably going to lose a lot of blood from that. And this is most people's favorite piece of music in the game. This is a, a piece called Before Dawn or At No, it's called At Dawn. It's uh, it's pretty good. I I don't think I think it's a little overrated, but it is pretty damn good. And this is all the stuff that, like, Knuckles would be doing. But, uh, we are Sonic, we are not Knuckles, we are not looking for the Master Emerald. Alright, I'm wasting time now. Yeah, pretty turned around there. Alright, here we go. Yeah, this this level or this this part of this level is very very different from like most of the other things that Sonic does. So it is a bit weird that it's you know it's so it's very open, and I do like that you can explore this area, but I mean you don't have to because there's nothing to do. But come on, dude. Yeah, if you found that bell in the in the Generations version of the level, you get a, a achievement or a trophy for it. What did Sonic just? What what was he doing? Why did he like yeah, move his bad. head? He never does that. Sonic has never once moved his head. All right, what do we do now? Who are you? What are you doing here? Were you going up and down and all around too? First time you've seen the train workers go on a strip. Oh my god, I forgot that this game has like weird, really weird little like subplots. And my microphone is caught on something. What is going on? There we go. It's a pain for everybody. Where are you? Oh, you're a chow egg. Can I really not throw this? There we go. Fuck the chow. Alright, so we did Radical Highway. We did Twinkle Park. The train's on strike. We have to find Amy. She should still Oh, she's over here. The 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 train strike 
uh, miraculously ends as soon as we find Amy by the casino. It's like, why even have it on strike? It's so pointless. Amy? Oh man, where can she be? Did anyone see Sonic, like, ruins. materialize from nothing there? Alright, here we go. Here we go! Yeah, it's just like, in a split second they were like, Oh, wait, we don't want to be on strike anymore. Let's go, uh, run the trains again. Doesn't make a lick of sense. Hunk of junk. Hey there, Bolt Brain. Bolt Brain. You better give Amy to me or I'll squash ya. These are all very quality sentences. Sonic looks like a serial killer there. Hey, what's happening here? Oh, it's the no texture mobile. Stop! Sonic, help me! Shoot! I've lost her again! That thing has cannons. I don't understand why it doesn't just like shoot at Sonic. And I feel like Robotnik doesn't really need Chaos to destroy a city. He can probably just use, uh, uh, whatchamacallit, he can most likely use just the Egg Carrier. I love doing this and just somehow ending up on the ceiling. It's so weird. Alright, so over here there's a monkey. There's a little monkey fella. Alright, who are you? I did see that flying battleship. I wonder who made it. You're wondering a lot of things, sir. This is the ancient light. Most pointless power-up ever. Toward the enemy. With this, you can now do the light speed attack. I never do this. It's useful against one boss and then that's it. Whoa, what was with all that slowdown? Ready. Ready? Go! Oh, it doesn't say go. That's unfortunate. Here's another fun level. I like this level a lot. But it's another one of those that I feel is a lot more designed for Knuckles than it is for Sonic. And this is the first time I think that we really get a cutscene before the level. Like, this is technically in the level right now. What? Some rockets require you to push. Of course they do. Whoa now. That would have been a bad touch. Taking all the shortcuts. This is, this is a speed run of Red Mountain. Uh, I am pro, uh, and I will be setting new world records in this video. So thank you very much for supporting me in my speedrunning endeavors. Is technically Sonic a speedrunner because he runs fast? Wow, that was awful. That was a bad joke. That wasn't even funny. I really do love this level. This is such a cool level. There's a lot of paths you can take. And, uh, again, it's one of those that has a lot of really neat musical parts in it. None of you electrified, right? Good. Whoa! Okay. Oh, God. 
Mad Cats, what have you done? Stop making terrible controllers, please. Please nerf. I'm gonna have to look that up after this if Mad Cats is still, like, in business. Because I feel like if they're still making, like, PS4 controllers, that's actually a crime. Because Mad Cats always makes really just awful products. Oh, camera, why? Why do you do this? Oh. Do we get to hear more of uh, Sonic's amazing ladder climbing noises? Mm mm. Mm mm. This actually kind of reminds me of Pumpkin Hill a little bit, this level. I don't know why. And here we get a really cool bit of music. But this part's always freaked me out, at least when I was a kid. It's just so bizarre, this whole part. Alright, we're gonna go back. Because... Oh, is this part gonna start filling up with lava? I don't know. Damn it! It's not worth it. It's just speed shoes. Sonic's already four fast, too cool. Now the part that would always freak me out as a kid is coming up because I never understood it. Is it up here? I think it's up here. It's up here somewhere. I should probably have gotten that checkpoint. Oh, definitely I should have gotten that checkpoint. What the fuck are you doing, Sonic? Oh no. Why did I not get that checkpoint? But yeah, the part that I always found weird and scary is over here. What, like, what are those? What are those things? What are they? They're scary. I don't know, I guess as a, as a kid there were a lot of, like, prison related things that scared me. Like, I guess I would always assume immediately if someone was in prison they were bad and scary. Like in um, Donkey Kong 64, I, I remember I rented that game once, and then there's that really big uh, Kong, or no, it's like a big alligator man that's in the in the jail. And uh, that guy is actually a good guy, but he always scared me as a kid. And now that game just scares me because it's bad. Also, those spider enemies are kind of creepy. This whole area is creepy. Let's get out of here. Dang it. Yes. Sonic, what are you doing with your head? Yeah, not bad. Yeah, not bad. Hey, Tails. There are a lot of really awkward pauses in that cutscene. Ready to roll, champ? Let's go! Roger! Let's watch Sonic's model miraculously transform.